loves, Miss Shelly Sims here and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today I bring to you a brand new episode of Jace and Oasis Springs. And I know, I know, I know, I know, I know you guys, today it looks a little bit weird because we are starting off with Casey. So if you guys don't know, Casey is pregnant with Jace's son and we do kind of need it to progress everything that is going on. I want to make sure that we kind of like intertwine her life as well as his in our uh, Jason Oasis Springs series. So the reason we are starting off over here is because right now, is because right now Casey's pregnancy is on pause, which I think we're going to keep it that way for quite some time. But today Casey actually has something super excited to exciting to do. She is going to be going to get an ultrasound, you guys. So that is what Casey is going to be doing. And we have not told our parents that we are pregnant. So she's just like, um, mom, I'm going to actually go somewhere today. I do need to go get an ultrasound and whatnot. And mom is just like, uh, right now. And she's like, no, it's going to be in the morning. So what we're going to do is we're going to have our ultrasound scan in the morning. We do need to kind of call Jace and let him know because, you know, guys always forget about stuff. So I'm going to have her call Mama. Jace and just kind of like Shows tell him like, hey, Jace, um, yes. we got to go to the hospital tomorrow to see a baby boy. No, and he's like, oh, yes, dang it. I, for I completely forgot. She's like, yeah, um, <laughs> the appointment is at 10 o'clock um, in the morning. He's like, okay. Um, of, of course, I'll, I'll be there. Um, she's like, uh, I know you don't have anyone to watch Gage, so my parents are actually very much okay with watching him tomorrow, so make sure you bring him over, and my mom and dad will watch him. He's like, okay, of course, sure, and you guys, she is super excited to go over. So this is their house right now. Casey does not have the best living situation. She still stays with her parents, and she stays with her, um, she stays with her, what am I saying? She still stays with her parents but she stays in this super super tiny compacted room right now and she wants to move but I think she's gonna try to make it work in this room with the baby and of course her parents stay here and this is pretty much their house here in Oasis Springs so a little bit of a backstory of behind her mother and father so they did get a divorce they separated but they did end up rekindling their um marriage they ended up like not actually getting a divorce they kind of like took a break from each other and they came back so they are actually back together which I'm super excited about but we're gonna go ahead and have Casey come in here and just sit down and watch some TV and possibly even you know just like a text of Jace and just be like you know how Gage is doing like how is he doing like we miss him so much like she loves a Gage and of course I'm pretty sure you you know, Jace is kind of like filling all the feels of being a dad and just having Casey around. But, you know, we're, we're super excited. But she is really just tired and she's kind of ready to get her. Well, she's not tired, but she's kind of ready to, like, get this night over with. So I'm going to have her come here and brush her teeth. Well, she'll do that after she takes a bath. So I have her come here take a bath and then brush her teeth. Her parents does not know that she's pregnant. And uh, but they're just out here talking right now. So I'm going to have them go ahead and come here and just go to sleep and you know Casey is keeping a big secret away from her parents I don't know if we're going to have her um kind of like a do a surprise announcement like I don't know if she would want to do anything like that but I think what we're gonna do is possibly have her do like a surprise gender reveal versus a surprise announcement and I do also want um Jace to give her a um I guess I want him to have like throw her a baby shower or we can leave that up to her appearance I don't really know but we're gonna intertwine everyone kind of like her family and um Jace his family we're gonna try because y'all know Jason his mom don't get alone but I'm gonna try to incorporate everyone that I possibly can and I don't know I just I don't know I'm I'm feeling really really attached to Jace and like his storyline you guys to be completely honest I am so attached to Jason his family and his story like I just love them so 
we'll see how everything goes but i'm gonna fast forward her getting a bath she is getting a little bit hungry so i'm also gonna make sure she uses the bathroom before she leaves and maybe she can like a, get a quick meal versus like having like a whole like situation so what i'll have her do is probably end up getting herself some lactose and free um yogurt and also let's cut their lights off in here y'all it kind of feels like i'm playing vanilla because there's no cc in this house and i'm loving it <laughs> but yeah she is just like kind of like in her like she's in this like mom era right like she is so excited to be a mother she also wants to really really bond with jace i mean not jace but um gage and she does know uh gage's mother but unfortunately like she she's like they're not close friends they probably met in passing but she is not really like interested in someone who is not being a good mother because she's like about to have her baby and well not have her baby but she's about to have a son of her own and she just could not imagine like someone not taking care of their kids but she is a little bit hungry so i'm gonna have her go ahead and eat and then we'll have her go to sleep and in the morning we will be heading over to the ultrasound oh my god i'm so excited for her like i i'm ready to see baby boy also we do need to discuss baby names with jace today uh well tomorrow we do need to discuss baby names with him so we can make sure we name our like they name their son something cute because jace is very particular about like what he want his, his kids names to be like he does not like like names that are too like I don't know he doesn't really mess around with the gender neutral names right so he's just kind of like eh, like I want him to feel like I don't know he wants his baby names to be very like hardcore so I guess we'll have to see what kind of names he wants but I'm gonna go ahead and let everyone sleep and I'll talk to you guys in the morning it is early in the morning and Casey cannot wait today is the day that she has been waiting for she finally gets to see baby boy today and she is so excited so we are gonna go ahead and wake her up she is a bit hungry so I'm gonna have her go ahead and wake up and we'll do auto lights because you know that's kind of like what helps the bills and she is very hungry this morning so I'm gonna have her come here brush her teeth she's not feeling the best we're gonna use the bathroom like she's just really trying to pass the time and not only that you guys but she is craving a sweet of food so I think what she's gonna probably end up doing is coming in here and she's like oh my god like what is like what's sweet like what's a sweet in this kitchen like I have to find something and I think what we can do is have her get some animal crackers and just like a get ready so we do have our ultrasound at 10 we need to make sure Jace is over here with Gage uh, but probably at like probably eight so we're gonna probably end up calling him after she finishes her animal crackers and she is like super excited so she is hiding this secret uh from her parents i don't know how they can't tell because i mean the massive belly right but she is hiding this news from her parents and they can't tell so i mean i wish i had the updated realistic birth mod that way she could like stand in the mirror and check her stomach out and oh my god she's uh, thinking of oh she's uh, thinking of a jace right now she's like oh my god like i cannot think i cannot wait until i see the look on his face when he sees baby boy today like oh she's just like thinking about all the feels but we're gonna hurry up and come in i guess we can possibly end up going in our parents room and changing our outfits so today is a hot day per usual in oasis of springs and i feel like she's always wearing this outfit so maybe we can take her in cast and pick her out like a different like a dress or something i don't know i just want her to have like a different like looks and oh yes guys so i got How a new you? loading screen i always get my loading screens from arena sims i hope i say her name right but i love 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 her loading screens so yes and i'm also obsessed with him on bagley and once i realized she made a him on bagley um him for the on back is yeah hanford on bagley um 
loading screen i was like oh, head over heels for it so i will have it linked in a, down in the description box below if you guys would like to check it out but for whatever reason when i think about casey i think about just like a full on a maxis like i don't think about putting her in anything like custom content like of course i do have custom content clothes but i think of her wearing something just like this like something super simple and super cute um i think honestly since she's having a boy i think this one would be really really cute but then i liked it the first one so i think we'll go with the first one and also i was thinking about changing her hair but a part of me really loves like the fluffy hair for casey but right now we are just really just laser focused on um just like changing her outfit and getting her ready to go see baby boy we will have to take off this so i don't know if this is you know what it'll it'll be fine so that is what she's gonna wear today to go see baby boy i know i just changed like literally one outfit <laughs> but i'm super excited about this so casey is just sitting down here she wants to drink some orange juice this morning she knows that she's not supposed to have like a coffee and stuff so i'm gonna just have her oh she i guess she wants to clean this up oh because she's nauseous okay go ahead and drink your orange juice this morning it is a seven so we're gonna go ahead and uh call jace over so he can have gage over here because if you guys don't know jace is a single father so he doesn't really have anyone single to watch gage so we're gonna go ahead and just invite him over here and wait on him and oh my god what is these things like i hate when these things are like floating above my sims but i'm pretty sure jace will be here soon and we're gonna go ahead and head on over to the hospital so, so jace is actually over here and oh no dad is super sick but of course we have little gage here and what i'm gonna actually have her do is bring gage in here and just like a sit him down or maybe we can even give him to our mother so we do have uh i guess a time to share the big news but we're not gonna do that yet because I don't think that she wants her parents to know because if you guys don't know, like she is not like her parents don't know anything and they're, I think they're going to be 100% supportive, but really like her having a baby, she's probably going to have to like get a job and get out. So we do need to make sure that it is definitely something, but we're going to go ahead and possibly give a gauge of back to daddy because we do have to call the hospital and let them know that we're coming. So that is what Casey is going to do. And she's like, oh my God, I cannot wait to go see our little bundle today. So let's go ahead and head out and I will see you guys once we get over there. So we are officially here and ignore the person over here with no bottoms. And like, she's like, oh my God, Jace, where did you go, my love? Okay, I think I'll have to probably end up calling him back over. I think like they leave automatically. So I'll just call him back over and we'll go ahead and get this started this person look you're gonna have to leave just go away like leave please and thank you okay there is jace i'm gonna go ahead and control him and we're gonna definitely have everyone come in here i think we have the ultrasound thing and we're gonna go ahead and start the ultrasound and i'm gonna have jace come in here and and be with casey because we do need to make sure that you know everything is okay she's like hey can you give me an ultrasound sound um, i'm here for my ultrasound and she's like okay come in the room and jace is over here i wish it could actually be a like participate but you know i don't know how all of that works just yet with the realistic birth mod but today we are looking at hopefully one baby boy and i'm super excited for casey because this is so important to her and you know this is the first time that we've ever seen oh Look at him. I think that's like, don't play with me, game. <laughs> but look at him, you guys. I cannot wait for them to start discussing like a baby names. Like Casey hasn't even thought about baby names, guys. Like she hasn't thought about baby names. Jace hasn't thought about baby names. Like nobody has thought about baby names. But she wanted her parents to know before 
they started thinking about like names and stuff so she cannot wait to go back home and show her parents this ultrasound but she wanted to keep it in because first off she's not staying in her own house right and then second off she is really just nervous like she's nervous she's the first time mom so it's to be you know to be understandable so she is just a super excited but the doctor is just like everything looks great with baby boy like he looks so healthy and yeah now you have an ultrasound you can finally show your parents so let's go ahead and read on what they said so it says congratulations you're pregnant based on the ultrasound it looks like you're expecting one healthy baby everything looks good so far but we'll continue to monitor your pregnancy and the baby's development and of course we are having a boy we already kind of knew that so I think what she is going to want to do is probably go over here with the Jace because Jace kind of like he was kind of a little bit like uh you know he didn't know what he was supposed to be doing but I think she is gonna go over here and possibly um show him the ultrasound so she is like oh my god Jace like I have something to show you and he's like what and she's like oh well first off I'm pregnant <laughs> <laughs> Which, I mean, we already technically knew, guys. But, like, this is the reaction that I was waiting for. But I think she had to get the... <gasps> like oh my gosh like we already knew she was pregnant but this is just like warming my heart I wonder if we can actually show him the actual ultrasound but he is super happy so we kind of already knew that Jace was happy about the pregnancy but the fact that that just like it solidified how I already knew he felt, guys. Like, we already knew he uh, he was happy about that. But I want her to actually show him, like, the ultrasound. If I'm not mistaken, I thought we were supposed to have a... Uh, I thought we were supposed to have a thing with an ultrasound and not just, like, that. We are officially back home, and she could not wait to run in here and share the news with her parents. I'm going to have a Jace coming here as well, and honestly, I think, oh, baby boy is still in here. So I'll have a Jace coming here and pick up a baby boy. Thank you guys so much for, you know, watching him and keeping an eye on him. But we have something to tell you, mom and dad, stop talking. It is big. Like, we have something something to tell you we want to share some news with you guys <laughs> She is like so excited. She's like, mom, mom, hello. Like mom and dad, come here, Jace. Like you need to be in here for this as well. And she's like, oh, she's, oh, you guys, look at this. Oh my God, you guys, look at our mom. Oh, look at this. I cannot. My heart, I cannot. Like we have like, oh, like her mother is so happy. Jace, babes, can you come and maybe come over here and put Gage down? Come over here and put Gage down. But mom is super excited about the baby. And now we have to tell dad, guys. We have to tell him the same thing. Like, we have to tell him that we're pregnant. Uh, but let me see. Where did I find that? Uh, I think it was in. Oh, it was just here. Okay, let's share the pregnancy news with our dad as well. We are super excited, but I don't even know how dad would feel. Wait, where are y'all going? Are y'all going outside? Okay, because I think the baby, like, I think Gage is trying to steal the shine. But, like, a Gage is going to have a baby brother. Oh, like, dad is happy too. Oh, my gosh. Ugh. These pictures, I cannot. So Casey's appearance, you guys, are super excited about having a baby. Uh, but he is actually, so he's actually not really feeling good. Honestly, he's stuffed up. He's overheating. You know, he's having all of the feels. But, you guys, it says congratulations. It says Reed is a thrill to hear the news and is ready to have prepared for the arrival of the baby. He can't wait to meet and spoil the little one. And I think our mother mother got the same exact mood lid so we are super excited like they're they're happy about the baby like we were she was so afraid that she wouldn't be happy about the baby but I also want Jace to pick up um, Gage and I do want him to kind of introduce um, it like 
her mother like she looks just like her mom but anyways i want um i well he needs to friendly introduce so friendly introduce to her and i want him to uh get gage acquainted oh, with casey's a family like thank you guys yeah, so much for a... watching <gasps> no her dad is burning to death oh my god casey i mean not casey but reed get your behind in the house hun you cannot burn to death please Get in the house and change your outfit. Like, what's happening? <laughs> like, what is happening? Okay, change your outfit. Get into your hot weather wear, babes. There we go. Guys, it's not changing. Is there a thermostat in here somewhere? Let me pop y'all a thermostat in here. So I am going to all, uh, okay, so I guess Gage was hungry, but now I do want him to uh, introduce Gage. How do I do that? I think that, okay, yes, introduce to Lynn because we want him to get acquainted. Like I want him to know that he has like a family and uh, y'all, Casey is super excited. She's happy that she was able to share the news with her uh, mom and dad. Sorry if it's Sound like I was far away from my uh, bike but like we want please go ahead and introduce him Jace I want you to introduce him and it's just like a, such a wholesome thing yes like introduce him how is he feeling I don't know guys he usually looks happy okay so she is going and hopefully she can like love on him and oh I think he's happy. Like, I think he's happy, guys. I she think that like, he's happy. And what she's going to do <laughs> is possibly introduce. Can she introduce him to him? What do y'all do? Why are y'all being flirty? <laughs> oh, okay. So they are being very, very flirty. So what I'm going to have Jason do is introduced to her dad as well because we need to get very acquainted with the family and Casey is just like laying here I mean sitting here and she's just like in awe because like I mean this is the best thing that she could ever happen like Jace is like getting along with her mom and dad her mom and dad are actually happy versus being like super like annoyed with like the pregnancy and like I think we're probably gonna end up throwing her a surprise like um a surprise like a uh, baby shower and whatnot eventually jace i don't know where you got this from babes but honestly i want you to get rid of this like i want you to get rid of it but mom unhand unhand the baby really really quickly uh can you give him back to jace Unhand the baby. <laughs> I think she's going to. Okay, thank you. And let's. Oops, I picked the wrong thing. And let's go ahead and get him to introduce uh, Gage to Casey's dad. And then we will have everyone acquainted and we may go ahead and switch over to Jace again. Or we could just hang out with his family. Um,. I think that that would be good. But how is he doing with um, Casey's dad? Like, he's just such a really, really nice baby. Like, he's really, really sweet. And did y'all get any sentiments from each other? Who is Zoe? <gasps> Jace! Who is Zoe and why? Okay, maybe this was someone he had already talked to. But he met Ayla. Um, Jason, he met Caroline. Boy, you better get yourself together. This is why he, I think this is why he won't be with her right now anyways, because he's not ready to fully commit. But Lynn thinks that Jace is fun to be around and Reed thinks Jace is also fun to be around. So that is really, really good. Boy, look, don't mess this up. Like, don't mess this up, please. Like, relax. <laughs> so Jace is back home and baby boy is not happy at all. He is honestly ready to come in here and go to sleep so i'll have jace go ahead and pop him in his well he is hungry right now so i'm gonna go ahead and have jace pop him in his crib and have him go to sleep poppy is like where have y'all been like i've been here by myself which feels like all day like hello <laughs> but poppy is super like jealous we do need to feed him so that's what we're gonna end up doing once we lay a gauge down for his afternoon nap oh my god look at this like why is he all the way down here hello <laughs> but i'm gonna go ahead and have a jay's a pop him in there i do think he is a fairly tired because he's just literally been like out all day like we had to go check on the baby okay we had to go check on check on your brother so ignore us but let's go ahead and also feed
made a poppy. Let's go ahead and clean up these uh, but dishes, pop this bread in the fridge and things like that. So while I was filming this episode, hello, can you please put him back in his crib? Like, what are you doing? Put Gage back in his crib. Y'all, I don't have a clue why Jace just, like, took him out of his crib. But, like I said, infants are crazily glitched. So, that's not surprising to me. But I'm going to have him. Go ahead. What is the matter? Oh, he's, like, trying to calm him down. What is the matter with you, babes? Okay, just go to sleep. Try to go night-night. Try to go night-night. Try to go night night, please go to sleep because daddy needs to do other things like a clean up and you are making this a fairly difficult. I'm going to get him to come in here and use the bathroom as well. And like I said, we need to go ahead and feed Poppy because Poppy, like I said, has been here all day by himself, by himself. So we need to make sure he is well taken care of. Don't worry, hun, we are coming, but I'm going to go ahead and also wrap up today's episode here. I love to play play a days honestly it's it's been feeling really really good to play like a days and stuff but i love this i love jason oasis springs but anyways i'm gonna go ahead and call poppy to the mill and a baby boy still has not went to sleep so i'm gonna have jace come in here and potentially um let's see um, I guess we could possibly, um, why is it not? Okay, soothe him to sleep, and I'm hoping Jace is successful. But I'm going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Of course, if you did, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.